Here you guys go. Two wheel drive Fortec 2.0. You're gonna see how well it drives. This is running on the six cell right now, then I'll do the same drive with the seven cell. You guys seen my little overview on the little update on my Fortec 2.0? That's two wheel drive swap. I did say that I just did this just for the hell of it. And plus, the real Ford GT and the Mustang are rear wheel drive. And I never seen anybody on YouTube actually two wheel drive swap in a Fortec, so I figured. This may be a first. So far it handles okay. Uh, and given judging by the fact that it's running on two wheel drive on dull bone stock tires. So yeah, when you're cornering, when you step on it, it just wants to do that. But once you're not doing that, it handles okay. All right, I'm gonna go get the seven cell. Now here it is, full throttle, two wheel drive on seven cell. <laughs> and yes, I got the stability management on for now. Once it does get up to speed, it does Go straight. I think um, with the two wheel drive swap, it probably can go a little faster than 30, 31 miles an hour, like as I recall from my previous speed run. Since uh, removing those two axles or dog bones is what you guys may call it uh, decreases some weight probably not a whole lot but enough that I can actually go faster than 31 I hope but we'll see because it sounds like it, it, it's going faster it's probably just because of the how bumpy the road is kind of this road is not perfect but it's flat enough for this car to run I've stepped on the gas too much. Don't worry folks, for those things, for those of you guys who think that I'm just ruining the car because it's two wheel, because I two wheel drive swapped it, don't worry, I'm gonna put back the all wheel drive system back on. This is just for temporary purposes. I won't be driving this thing around a track in two wheel drive, obviously. But it's just okay to add a little bit of some realism to it since the real Ford GT is rear-wheel drive. So is the Mustang. And oversteer. See, it's really hard to control. Especially when I'm just holding with one hand. Now you guys may think, not may think, but you guys are probably thinking, how well does it do 
with two wheel drive with drift tires. <laughs> I'll tell you this that every time I step on the throttle and at least turn it just a little bit, the car just wants to spin out. It's not really this car this chassis is not designed for two wheel drive, like I like I said, but But it's just so much fun to kick in the rear end, you know? Just have a little fun with it. body got caught there I just saw it it's no big deal though at least I got saved all right one more pass I'm gonna go get myself uh, another Ford GT body with this one. So this one's gonna have a this, this GT body will have a some scratch scratches and stuff. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be planning to do. I'm gonna be putting another Ford GT body on it, trying to make it look like the Forza cars, the Forza Ford GTs and stuff. And yeah, well, there's some scratch on this one, but at least it's still in one piece. So yeah.